Hello everyone, my name is Lou. I'm a solutions architect with AWS. And today I'll be showing you how to configure access to Maintenance Window, a shared services component of Systems Manager. To use Maintenance Window, you must first create a role so that Systems Manager can act on your behalf when creating and processing maintenance windows. To create an IAM role for maintenance windows, first open the IAM console at console.aws.amazon.com. In the navigation pane, choose Roles, and then choose Create New Role. In step one, set role name. There you can enter a name that identifies this role as a maintenance window role. Then click Next. In step two, select role type and choose Amazon EC2. The system skips step three, establish trust because this is a managed policy. In step four, attach policy, choose Amazon SSM maintenance window role. And click next step. In step five, review, make a note of the role name and role arm. You will specify the role ARN when you attach the IAM pass role policy to your IAM account in the next procedure. You will also specify the role name and the ARN when you create a maintenance window. Now choose Create Role. The system returns you to the Roles page. Locate the role you just created and double click it. Choose the Trust Relationships tab and then choose Edit Trust Relationship. Add a comma after ec2.amazonaws.com and then add service colon ssm.amazonaws.com to the existing policy. Choose Update Trust Policy. Copy or make a note of the role ARN. You will specify this ARN when you create your maintenance window. Now we're going to configure account permissions. Systems Manager must assume your role so that it has permission to perform the actions you specify for your maintenance window. Use the following procedure to attach the IAM pass role policy to your existing IAM user account, or create a new IAM account and attach this policy to it. If you create a new account, you must also attach the Amazon SSM full access policy so the account can communicate with the Systems Manager API. To attach the IAM pass role policy to your user account, go to the IAM console navigation pane, choose users, and double click your user account. In the manage policy section, verify that either the Amazon SSM full access policy is listed or there is a comparable policy that gives you permission to the systems manager API. In the inline policy section, choose create user policy. If you don't see this button, Choose the down arrow beside Inline Policy and then choose Click Here. On the Set Permissions page, choose Policy Generator and then choose Select. Verify that Effect is set to Allow. From AWS Services, choose AWS Identity and Access Management. From Actions, choose Pass Role. In the Amazon Resource Name field, paste the role name you created in the previous procedure. Choose Add Statement, and then select Next Step. On the Review Policy page, choose Apply Policy. Thank you for watching this video. In the next video, I'll demonstrate how to create a maintenance window.